here at the grave of Rudy Verba. We're going to do three traditional Jewish prayers. One is special for Rudy. It's said in synagogue, not around the grave. It's called Birchat HaGomel, the blessing of being saved which is ironic, a man who himself saved over 100,000 other souls, himself was saved as one of the few to escape the most infamous death camp in human history. This blessing, Hagomel, is a blessing of thanksgiving. It's said by women after childbirth, by people after taking a dangerous trip, after being released from prison, or in Rudy's case, after escaping. Baruch ato Adonai Eloheinu melech haolam hagomel lechayevim tovod shigamalani kol tov. I was aware uh, that in Israel, Rudolf Herba was not known. And I talked with Professor Yehuda Bauer, the foremost Holocaust historian, about that and uh, uh, had a private argument with him about that until he finally gave up. This is the Torah cover from Prague, a couple hundred kilometers from where Rudy was born. and the Torah that will lay on his grave, which also tells the story of the Exodus and the escape of Abraham and Sarah and so much of Jewish history that was lived in exile on the mountains and in the valleys and in the graves and in heaven. And then I go to Yad Vashem, the Holocaust Remembrance Authority in Jerusalem. And I find the Hungarian section, see nothing about Rudy Verba. This is about 20 years ago. And uh, I thought, here's a man who's deserving a pavilion, you know, or at least a major section, uh, because how will people know that the Verba Wetzler report? had consequences that included the rescue of 100,000 Jews. This blessing, the El Malay Rachamim, God filled with mercy, is said as the traditional memorial prayer. Usually three, sometimes four times a year. Now said for the first time, not only at Rudy's grave, but since he was buried by anyone in his memory, in his honor. <laughs> Bima Allah had Kidashi Mute Horim Kizay had a Rakia Masirim Es Nishmat Rudi Ben Mordechai Ben Eliahu Vachana She Allah Leolamo. I really don't know how he felt about Israel's failure to recognize him. All I, all I do remember about his, his history is that he actually went to Israel and worked there for two or three years. And we never talked about that. He never brought it up. Oh God, full of mercy, who dwells on high, 
grant proper rest on the wings of the divine presence to the souls of Rudolf Verba, his relatives, and all our people, the holy and pure ones who were killed, murdered, slaughtered, burned, drowned, and strangled for the sanctification of the name by the Nazi German oppressors and their collaborators whose name and memory should be obliterated. May the resting place of our dear ones be in the Garden of Eden. May the Master of Mercy shelter them beneath his wings for eternity and bind their souls in the bond of life. Hashem is their heritage. May they repose in peace. Venomar, Amen. He said Auschwitz was a place where everything was permissible. Now, obviously it wasn't for the Jews, but for the tormentors, the torturers, the Nazi doctors, everything was permissible. Everything. And I cannot imagine that there was anything that humans could not do to another human that was not done there. Alan will place a memorial stone as a sign that Rudy and other brave souls not be forgotten. The mourner's Kaddish, the mourner's prayer. Yitkadal vitkadash shumei rabah v'yalma divrach yirutei v'yamlich malchutei v'chayechon v'yamechon v'chayei d'chol beit Yisrael v'gala v'yizman kari v'yimeru amein Yehesh me rabba mavarach lelam, wal me al maya. Yit parach vit tabach vit par vit romam vit nase. Vit adar vit ale vit alau shme de kudesha brichu. Leila min kol birchata vishirata tushbechat evenechamata. Damiran belma vimeru amen. Yehei Shlomo Rabba min Shemaya v'chaim aleinu v'al ko Yisrael v'imeru. Amen. Ose shalom b'imremav hu yase shalom aleinu v'al ko Yisrael v'imeru. Amen.